Psalm 73 talks about rich fools. And people who are rich and proud and lifted up and full of themselves oftentimes might have a way of gathering a following, getting people to wonder at them and think maybe a little bit highly of them anyways because they're already <laughs> presenting themselves as someone who's lifted up. And oftentimes people will look at that person and just think that they should be lifted up because they're just walking around lifting themselves up. And we don't want to fall into this trap or look at them or envy them, envy their position, envy their wealth, envy their uh, prosperity. Look at verse number one, Psalm 73. The Bible says, Truly God is good to Israel, even to such as are of a clean heart. But as for me, my feet were almost gone. My steps had well nigh slipped. For I was envious at the foolish when I saw the prosperity of the wicked. For there are no bands in their death, but their strength is firm. They are not in trouble as other men, neither are they plagued like other men. Therefore, pride compasseth them about as a chain. Violence covereth them as a garment. So he's saying, I was envious at foolish people when I saw their prosperity. I saw how good things were going for these people. And I became envious. Hey, they have everything so good. I want some of that. I, 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 man, must be nice to be these rich fools it says there's no bands in their debt. Their strength is firm. There's, they seem to have everything going for them. They seem to be strong all the way until the day they die. They, they are not in trouble as other men, and they're not plagued like other men. They, they don't have these worries. They don't have the same problems that you and I have. They seem to have everything together. Everything seems to be going well for them. And because everything's going well for them, because they don't have all these problems, they're like, oh, man, I've got one problem after another coming my way. But these guys, not a care in the world. Everything just seems to be going their way. And it says, therefore, pride compasseth them about as a chain. Yeah. It's easy to get lifted up in yourself when things continue to just go well and well and well for you. And you're not brought to a position where you need to rely on someone else. You're not brought down. You're allowed to just keep puffing yourself up, puffing yourself up. Verse number seven, their eyes stand out with fatness. They have more than heart could wish. Again, people will look at people like this that have all these riches and they become envious of them. And it's not right. And we're going to see that in this psalm. Verse number eight, they are corrupt and speak wickedly concerning oppression. They speak loftily. They set their mouth against the heavens and their tongue walketh through the earth. Therefore, as people return hither, and waters of a full cup are wrung out to them. And they say, how doth God know? And is there knowledge in the Most High? Basically, the attitude of, I can do whatever I want. How's God? Who's God? How's God going to know what I do? Don't care. Everything's going good for them. What God? Remember, Pharaoh was like, who is the Lord? When Moses said, let my people go. Who, who's the Lord? I could keep treating you guys bad, and who's going to see it? Who's going to know? That's the attitude of the people who are fools, lifted up in themselves, full of wealth. And the psalmist here is saying, I was envious of them. To be in that position, to have that wealth, to just be able to live and seemingly have nothing going wrong. I mean, up until the day they die, they don't seem to have the problems that I do. Man, it must be nice to be in their position. They could do whatever they want and get away with it. They could kill somebody and say, the glove doesn't fit. You got to quit. <laughs> right? I mean, you could, you could get away with whatever you want to get away with. 